Thanks for using the G3 XFT foot drop system. Now let me introduce how to use this product. First, let's see the configuration of this product. The patient kit foot drop system consists of one stim unit, one remote control, one charger, two non-woven electrodes, and five pairs of hydrogel electrodes. Here is how to use it. First, take out the non-woven electrode and wet it with running water. Saline water is better. Wipe out extra water, then install the electrode on the cuff in the right direction according to colors. The cuff should be fixed about two centimeters under the knee and the stim unit should be positioned inside your leg medial. Please note that the yellow mark on the cuff needs to be aligned with the tibia. Now, let's turn on the stim unit and the remote control. Press the power button of the stim unit and the green light is on. Press the power button of the remote control and the screen is on. Press the mode button to choose different modes. In training mode, there is a sitting icon on the screen. Press play pause button to start training mode. Press plus or minus to adjust intensity. Training mode provides the passive training suitable for patients who can barely walk. To produce more eversion or dorsiflexion, you can just slightly move the cuff up or down, right or left. In smart mode, a walking icon is displaying on the screen. Press play pause button to start. Then press plus or minus to choose appropriate intensity. For starters, it is recommended to use foot drop system twice a day, in training mode and gait mode for 20 minutes respectively. Later on, patients can prolong use time based on personal conditions. Please dry and store the electrodes after use. Tips for electrodes placement. Non-woven electrodes. Move the cuff down about four to six centimeters away from the knee for more dorsiflexion and less eversion. Move the cuff outward about one centimeter for more eversion and less dorsiflexion. Hydrogel electrodes. First, find the fibular head. Place the black electrode about one thumb distance under fibular head and put the red electrode on tibialis anterior where exactly down the black electrode. In such way, there will be more eversion and less dorsiflexion. Place the black electrode about one thumb distance under the fibular head and put the red electrode on tibialis anterior about 7 to 10 centimeter under the black electrode. In such way, there will be more dorsiflexion and less eversion. Place the black electrode on tibialis anterior about 5 centimeter under the knee. Put and align the red electrode under the black electrode. In this way, it only has dorsiflexion.